The trailer driver is always responsible for the transport. However, as it is your excavator, you can help make sure that nothing untoward happens during the transport. Line up the undercarriage so that it follows the center of the trailer. Follow the driver's instructions when tracking forwards. Operate slowly so you can finally adjust the direction. Balance with the help of the excavator's digging equipment when entering the low body. This is to avoid tipping, which would prove awkward both for the excavator and the trailer. Depending on the type of trailer, the digging equipment can be placed both in a folded and an extended position. Follow the driver's instructions. Most importantly, make sure that the lowest possible transport height is obtained. Otherwise, if the excavator is too high, severe damage could be caused to bridges and similar structures. The safest method, of course, is to measure. Securing the excavator is not your responsibility. However, you can instruct the driver where the anchor points are located on the machine. Hook into the holes in the undercarriage and not the track shoes. Chains are attached diagonally lengthways and one chain is used to secure the cross movements. The same applies both at the front and at the rear. Fold in all the mirrors and any accessories that are likely to increase the transport width. Disconnect the main switch. Lock all the doors and hatches because the high turbulence could cause them to fly open and result in damage. After a final walk around to check that everything looks normal, the transport is ready to leave. 